Hello everyone, welcome to another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about this dual wireless budget friendly microphone. So welcome back to another video. My name is Mario So and I create weekly content on filmmaking, photography and gear review. If that's something you think you'll be into, don't forget to hit the like button and the subscribe button for more content. So today we'll be reviewing this Kimofen wireless microphone for two people. A few weeks ago, I reviewed pretty much the exact same microphone, but it was just for one person. It only had one transmitter, but this new one that I received has two transmitters and one receiver, meaning that you're able to use one wireless mic set for two people. This video isn't sponsored, but I was sent this microphone to test and to give it my thoughts. So let's check out what's in the box. So first impressions, let's talk about some of the things that I really like. I like that it comes in a nice little pouch and the fact that it comes with so many accessories to get you started. You're able to use this wireless set on a camera for regular videos that you're shooting. You can use it on your phone if you do not have a camera yet and you want to improve your audio quality or you're doing video interviews on the go with your phone and you need to mic up two people. Or if you're doing some sort of online Zoom training, Zoom class or whatever, and you have two people that will be speaking and they have to be socially distanced. That way you're able to mic these two people at the same time and feed them both through one channel to your Zoom meeting. If that's something you think you'll need, then this might be an option to consider. Most of the time, if I'm filming interviews with two people, I'll have two mic sets running around. So I have two receivers and two transmitters. Now I'll feed the audio coming from those two wireless microphones into two audio recorders or into one audio recorder that has different channels. The benefits of this is that I can adjust the gain or the volume for each of these two wireless microphones. But if you don't have audio recorders with multiple channel inputs, or if you want to just simplify your workflow, but you need to interview two people or get two audio sources, then this might be a simple option for you. This set is about $90 US. It comes with actually four microphones. So two lavalier microphones and two headset microphones. You're able to mix and match these microphones. So you can use one lapel microphone on one person and a headset on another person or two headsets on two people or two lavalier mics on two people. In terms of build quality, these are made of plastic and they're quite flimsy in my opinion. So if you were to drop one, then you might need to get yourself a new one. So don't drop them. The microphones feel quite good. They have a very long cable, which is a good thing. And the headset seems like it's pretty well built. So this set charges in about three to four hours and it's good for six to eight hours of continuous use, according to the manufacturer. One accessory that I like that they included is a triple charger micro USB cable. We're still not getting a USB-C charger with these microphones, but that's not a deal breaker. The fact that this USB charger splits into three, that means that you're able to charge all of these three at the same time. You're able to charge the receiver and the two transmitters. Straight out of the box, this microphone is very easy to use as well. It pairs very easily. You just turn them on and wait for them to pair. If the lights are flashing, it means that the units are trying to connect with each other. As soon as the light turns solid, that means that the units have been paired and they're ready to use. 
If they flash red, that means that the battery is about to go out. I like the fact that the transmitters have a volume control. You're able to increase or decrease the volume from the two people that you have mic'd up. There's no LCD screen or anything that tells you what volume you're at. So you're going to have to monitor and listen in and do a test before you start recording. So let's jump into the audio test for these microphones. I'm going to be switching now to these microphones. In three, two, one. So the audio that you're hearing right now is coming from this Kimofun wireless microphone. And as you can hear, this is what it sounds like without any post-processing applied to it. There's no way to check the gain or the volume level of this microphone set. So you just have to go and check the, the levels on your audio or listen to it before you start recording. I'm increasing the volume on the transmitter right here. Hello, testing, one, two. You might be able to hear it clipping right now as I'm going all the way up. So let's turn it back down a little bit more. Hello, testing one, two, check. All right, so this is just with me speaking. Um, unfortunately, I don't have someone else here right now that can help me test the dual functionality of this microphone. So I'm going to be using my phone and have it play over here and I'll mic it up to whatever I'll be playing on my phone so that you can hear both of these microphones coming in at the same time. So I'll be turning on this second transmitter right now. Let's turn it on. And as soon as you turn it on, the light turns green, solid green, that means it's paired. It really literally only takes about two seconds for it to pair. So it's a pretty simple system to use. I recorded myself in the past so I can test this dual microphone for you guys to have a listen. Hey, how's it going? Thanks for having me in this video today. No problem, thanks for being here. Yeah, I heard you needed a second person. So I just came just to help you test this dual microphone. Yeah, thanks so much, what do you think? Well, I don't know, it feels, you know, it sounds pretty good considering I sound pretty, pretty bad right now because I'm speaking through a phone, but it sounds not bad. What do you think? Yeah, I think it sounds pretty good for the price. I mean, $90, you get a dual wireless microphone set. So yeah, it's not bad. So let's add some post-processing to this microphone right now. So this is what the microphone sounds like with a little bit post-processing applied in the edit. So as you were able to hear just now, there were two of us speaking. And even though the audio coming from my phone is probably not as good as the quality of the audio coming from me, but you get an idea of what these two microphones sound like together. The drawback though is that these two audio sources get mixed into one when you're recording. So if you wanted to adjust the volume of the two people separately later on in post, you won't be able to do that. So let's head outside and do a range test. One, two. 4, All right, so right now I'm about 50 feet from the camera. I'm not sure if you can still hear me. This is what it sounds like. There's little to no wind out here. I'm going to keep going a little bit further and, and see if the connection breaks or not. All right, so here I'm about 100 feet. I'm not sure if you can still hear me or if the connection's breaking. 100 feet is a uh, range test. Hello, testing. I'm about 120 feet away. This is way past the maximum range that this microphone says it has. So we'll see if you can hear me. I think you can hear me. It's probably breaking, but yeah, let's push this mic range test to its limit. All right, let's get back now. I'm going to keep talking and then you'll be able to hear me or not. Let's see if the connection gets better as I get closer. And because it's just me by myself, I can't test both mics at the same time, but the manufacturer says the mic range it's the same for, you know, when you have two of these running at the same time, so. Just like the single unit wireless kit, this microphone actually performs quite well for its price. I like that they include all accessories to get started, whether you're filming on your phone, on your camera, or on your computer. I also like that it's super easy to set up, and if you are not experienced with wireless microphones or different frequencies, all you need to do is just turn it on. As soon as the light flashes red, you have to charge these sets, and if you're in the middle of a shoot, then you're gonna have to tell them to wait while you charge these things. Don't expect top-notch audio quality out of this set, but if you are on a budget and you need to record two people most of the time or occasionally, or you would like to have that ability, and if you only need one microphone most of the time, then this is pretty good. You can use it as one microphone. And when it comes to time that you need to record two people at the same time, then you already have the extra transmitter. So I hope you enjoyed today's video and if you haven't subscribed, please hit that subscribe button and be in the know of future content that I'll be creating. That is all for today guys, until next time.